Hi students, welcome to our channel. In today's lecture, we are going to learn about Raman effect. And also we will learn about what is experimental arrangement of Raman effect. Before going to the Raman effect, we will learn what is scattering of light. Here we see the animation of the scattering of light. When a beam of light incident on the particles of the substance, then the small amount of light is travel in different directions. This is known as scattering of light. Now we see the definition of the Raman effect. In 1928, Raman observed that the spectrum of scattered light having greater and small frequencies of incident beam of light. This is known as Raman effect. That spectrum is called Raman spectrum. Now we see the what is Stoke lines and anti Stoke lines of. Now we see the what is Stokes lines and anti Stokes lines of the Raman spectrum. The lines having greater frequency than incident beam are called anti Stokes lines. The lines having smaller frequency than incident beam are called Stokes lines. The new lines are called as Raman lines. Rayleigh observed that in the spectrum of scatter light, there is change in intensity of light, but there is no change in wavelengths or frequency. This is known as Rayleigh scattering of light. Now we see the this diagram, then we get full clarity on Raman effect. Here we see a molecule doing vibrations along this direction then we incident a laser beam of frequency E0 then we get Rayleigh scatter light which is having frequency of scattered beam equal to frequency of the incident beam here we see the E equal to E0 and also we get Raman anti stoke Raman anti stokes scatter light. Here we see the E is greater than the E naught. That means frequency of scattered beam is greater than the frequency of the incident beam. That is we called as anti stokes. Previously we discussed what is anti stokes and and also we see this Raman Stoke scatter light. Here we have E is less than the E naught. That means E is frequency of scatter light that is less than the frequency of the incident beam. This is all are about Stokes lines and anti Stokes lines. Here we see anti Stokes lines spectrum. Here is H mu is incident beam of light, then we get the H mu naught scatter light. In anti Stokes lines, lambda dash is less than the lambda. That means lambda dash is the frequency of the scatter light, and the lambda is frequency of the incident light. Okay, in Rayleigh scattering we have h mu that means incident beam is equal to the scattered beam the frequency of the scattered beam equal to the frequency of the incident beam in stokes lines we have the frequency of the scattered beam the frequency of the scattered beam is greater than the frequency of the incident beam. I hope that you understand the what is 
Stokes lines and anti Stokes lines. Now we see the experimental arrangement of Raman effect. Now we see the experimental arrangement for the Raman spectrum. Here we have mercury arc lamp S and filter F and a reflector R and also we have a Raman tube and also we have a spectrograph and a reflector R the mercury arc lamp S yes, that is source of the light which is passing through the filter then we get a monochromatic light that is single frequency beam of light which is falls on the reflector then falls on Raman tube. In Raman tube we have two ends. At one end we have flat glass plate which is emerges the scatter light for the spectrograph and another end we have horn shape which is provide black background to the experiment. Raman tube consists 1 to 2 cm diameter and 10 to 15 cm of length which is surrounded by water jacket to preventing the overheating of the Raman tube. In this section we place experimental sample. When we place experimental sample into Raman tube then we get the signals to spectrograph light from source through filter and reflector and directly falls on Raman tube then it is go through flat glass end to the spectrograph then we see the difference in incident beam of light and scattered beam of light I hope that you understand the class please subscribe my channel comment like and share please support us thank you